Hello Promising Traders, Alex here from PromisingTrader.com with your Bitcoin update. This is the monthly view of Bitcoin, this is only paper trading advice, remember I only give you one version, I don't give you two scenarios and because I give you the one that I believe to be the most likely, if I'm wrong and if you follow me you will be wrong as well, it's a very high risk. You need to do your own due diligence unless you do paper trading, in which case you can do exactly what I'm saying because you're not going to lose money. If you want to know how to set up TradingView for a paper trading account and how to trade and modify your trades on a paper trading, just check the top right corner. There is a video in which I show you that and also I show you how to use my candle scanner. Uh, sorry, I noticed something a little weird because I've been tweaking it. So the sensitivity is very important, which is something that you will need to see in that video. This one is a shooting star. It was being shown as an inverted hammer, which is not. It's still at the top of a bull run. Anyway, uh, along with the candle scanner, I also send you strategies and things. So you need to download this from me. I will send you an email with the link, uh, with the instructions and how to download it, and, the, um, and then I will send you also my strategies and videos about uh, trading that you may find useful in case you want to become a profitable trader. Now, let's begin. Bitcoin this month looks really bad. Actually, even though it's not yet uh, as big as this, looks even worse to me, quite frankly. It looks like it's not going to make anything. now. We have already uh, the crossover of uh, MACD from the top to the bottom of the signal, which is a very bearish sign. Mark RSI, which is now below 50, which is obviously if we divide RSI in two halves, the upper half is going from 50 point whatever, more than 50 to 100 and the below 50 is bearish basically. And nothing. Let's go to the weekly and let's see what the week does. But it doesn't look very nice. In fact, it's the bearish week of the last four. So it's the in one month, this one looks like it's the worst in terms of um, green, <laughs> in terms of bull performance. And at this point, what I can see here is a nearly a double bounce on RSI. Obviously, we need to see how it's going to look like when it's done. But if it double bounces here, we may have a reversal and the price obviously is closing below the previous low. But we need to see because I don't believe there's going to be a reversal yet. I, need, I think that the price will drop below 5,000 more likely. And let's check what we can see in the daily by revealing also all the mess that there is in here. Let's give it time to show also this downtrend corridor. Okay, so we can see that Bitcoin is definitely back inside this downtrend white channel. You see this white line. What am I dragging that is not moving where I want it to move? Okay, you see this white line. It's been crossed here and then it fell and it's now back in. Actually, it's it's back in and it's actually pointing to the half of it. You see? Boom. And if I must really find a, another target, that would be here at 59-ish, 100. Why? Well, there was a little bit of resistance here. I don't know what my dog did. Sorry. Uh, and let me make it green so far. Because remember, I said we need to see a reversal, a, a retest of this line here. Well, I don't know if, if there's going to be one, quite frankly. It doesn't look like so far, but obviously the day is just begun. So at least for me, because it's uh, nearly nine in the morning in the UK, so it's eight forty-three, like as you can see here. But unless I see another reversal pattern within this support, which is the the bottom of this, I'm not really sure. And in fact, I was saying we need to see whether it does it or not. If you remember, and it's not looking like it's going to do it. So 
if it drops, if it doesn't make any reversal in here, eventually it will go below that and the next target must be this. In other words, 5,753-ish. Okay, so let me see what we can spot if there is potentially a reversal pattern forming in here so that we retest this support line. Let's go in the six hours and try to figure it out. Well, it is definitely slowing down, but if you can see, RSI is dropping and uh, here the price is more or less the same and possibly here we will see a new high. It looks like so, but we're still three hours. This candle is halfway through, so ugh, it's very difficult to tell. And if we don't see RSI closing above the previous low we, when the price drops down in here, I don't think we will see it very soon. And actually, we won't see it very soon anyway. In my opinion, if we check MACD, it takes a while now for MACD to revert. So it's, it's not happening yet. So yeah, we may probably expect for today either nothing happens more likely nothing happens or maybe we cross down actually i don't think it's very likely for it to close above the the, the previous highs quite frankly or close above anything actually it's probably either go sideways or drop in the three hours we can see that macd is actually showing a little bit of a reversal but we had this uh, hammer we had these hammers, we had the bull army, and nothing has been actually working, meaning that the price is destined to drop, and this hammer also is being denied. So yeah, I am more confident that this is a downtrend, and that despite MACD is showing a possible reversal in the histogram, we will see now Bitcoin closing below 6,526, which is this green line in here. Let me go in the hour. And yeah, there was here a reversal, which probably has occurred, shooting star, the top. And now it's again pointing downwards. So if we're lucky, we see a retest of this, but I believe we will not, and the price will keep dropping very soon. So, nope, no optimism today for Bitcoin doing the retest of this line, actually. So, chances are more likely that it either goes sideways for all the day, or if it has to make a move, the move will be down. Yeah, I think so. Anyway, I think I'm done for today. I will see you tomorrow with another update. Please, if you enjoyed the video, just like, share and subscribe. You will help me a lot. If you didn't like the video, please let me know in the comment why, so that I will know what to improve next time. And I hope to see you tomorrow with another update. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Bye-bye.